Yo, what up guys? I'm Sammy and welcome back to the Soul Brothers channel. Today we're going to be talking about some of my favorite KDs in his line, Kevin Durant's signature line. And uh, this got me thinking because uh, apparently, I, I believe it was Bleacher Report, but somebody asked Kevin Durant what his favorite shoe was. So it says here, Easy Money Sniper, I'll put it up right here. And it says his favorites are 2, 4, 6, 8, 12. So there's no odd numbers, which is interesting. But it, it's not interesting though. Like you would think, like I, I believe Kobe was asked this question as well, but he said he couldn't pick because they were all his babies. You know, but KD's just like straight up, he's like, yeah, this is my favorite, which is interesting. And that makes you wonder, like, you know, he was, he's very heavily involved in the design process. And I guess you would have your favorites, right, right? Like if I had a signature line like KD, I would probably say the same thing as Kobe. You know, I, I can't pick, I love all of my shoes. But he's very straightforward. So I have the four to the 13, where is the 13s right over here? So four to the 13, I have not played in the one through three. So, but he says two. Right, he says two, and I, I don't know if like what's his favorite out of these five, um, but he says two. I haven't played in two. Four is incredible. This is very very nice. The six I also really really like. The eight I did not like, and then the twelve, which I like. So I posted a KD picture on Instagram and got a lot and a lot of comments on what you know. I asked you guys, what's your favorite KDs? And I got a lot of comments, so we're gonna go through that as well. For me, in my opinion, my favorite KDs, uh, so I really like the 12. I really, really like this. I, if we're gonna put in elites as well, I love the five elite. A little bit more than the five, just a regular five, because this is a high, and uh, just, just the low feels a little bit better to me. Uh, so the 12, the five elite, the six, and the four, and then the 13. The 13, right, I mean, I haven't played in them yet, but I've been like running around, I've been like dribbling here, like in my living room, where it's like a wood floor, and it's feeling super duper nice. Well, obviously that's all speculation right now, we don't know yet, but everything else, like the only thing I don't know about is the traction, obviously. I mean, it is a wood floor, but uh, the surface, like the finish is a little bit different on the basketball court, so that's the one thing that I don't know about, but everything else, like the fit, the material quality is very good, but it feels very thin and minimal, which I like on foot. And the cushion feels really really nice so uh, everything about this shoe is feeling like really good so far so let's look at your guys's favorite so shout out to nightwing he's one of my favorite shoe people and uh if you guys didn't know i got into shoes like doing this all of this because of nightwing so shout out to him i respect his opinion so he says the seven the seven and then the five and then the 12 and then the nine in that order which um, I agree with a little bit, you know, obviously all of this is just personal taste. I'm not saying he's wrong. I'm not saying I'm right. Everyone has their own taste. And for me personally, the seven was really good. The seven's really, really nice. You know, I, I like the, the materials, the overall fit and everything. The traction's really good. But I, I, when I was playing in this, I rolled my ankle like two to three times. And, um, and that, that was because of this air unit and it felt very, very unstable for me. And uh, that's just for me. You know, I'm not saying that's for everyone. So that's why the seven, I like never really played in again because I rolled my ankle so many times in this. But yeah, I, I really like how it looks too. You know, all, like the colorways that came out with this shoe as well was really, really dope. And looking at all the comments, there were a lot of 12s and a lot of fours. Mixed in the middle were a lot of nine and tens. You know, basically the same shoe kind of. Very, very similar performers, you know. Uh, and I believe there were a good amount of sixes, eights, and fives. So shout out to the Soul Squad for you know commenting. But yeah, that's interesting because uh, I mean his entire line is just solid. All of these are solid, solid performers. Uh, one of my least favorite though is probably the eight. There's a few reasons. The traction just wasn't good on dust. The zoom unit was super nice, but I hated how it felt because it felt very unstable right here where the ball of your foot is. So like when you when you're like uh, like playing, this part just like collapses a lot. So I didn't really like that. The fit was very, very narrow for me as well, which is interesting. Like it, it gave me needles and no matter how much I broke it in, it still gave me needles. I mean, I really like the, how the shoe looks though. But other than that, probably the eight is probably one of my least favorite performers. But, and then everything else is like solid, you know? And of course, shout out to Leo Chang because he is like one of the main designers for the entire KD line. And also like the first 
part of Kyrie's line and he you know all of them look solid you know like there's really not one that I like don't like as far as aesthetics go my least favorite is probably the 11 I don't really like how it looks I, I really don't like the small smoosh uh, but everything else looks great well in my opinion and it's pretty crazy to see how like things have changed you know uh, like his early lineup I guess obviously the Air Max was the premium cushioning setup back then but then his like his cushioning setup in his older shoes like the four, the five, the five elite. I guess not the six elite. <laughs> uh, the six, I guess. Uh, the seven, I guess. Also a little bit. We're all segmented and more like responsive, you know. But um, like once you get into like the eight, the nine, or like through the thirteen, they're all like full length zoom units. That's probably because Nike's Nike was putting trying to put KD's line up into like the upper echelon of like higher quality you know best tech type of shoes so that's probably what happened or, or maybe katie's taste change i don't really know uh or maybe a, a little bit of a mix of both so yeah that's uh, my list i'm very surprised kd didn't like the nine through the ten oh he, he doesn't say he didn't like them but it's not in his list which is kind of interesting because he kept this cushioning setup the exact same because i heard he really liked the nine so he kept it the same in the ten but uh, i guess it's not in his list, right? Tell us what your favorite performers are of KD's line down in the comment section below, as well as like his best looking shoes. But that's it. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.